Behind the wheel for this worldwide effort was Yukio Kamiyama, chief development driver responsible for Nissan's legendary R32 and R33 Skyline GTR. While leading the team was the father of Nissan's award-winning VQ engine, Motohiro Matsumura. Since this engine was being made for the SER, we wanted to make the RPM range greater than usual. Based on that goal, we changed almost every part related to increasing air intake efficiency, the main engine elements, the camshafts, and so on. It's the longest straightaway at the ring, from Dudinger Hoa to Antonius Brook. Two kilometers of running flat out may leave you breathless, but not the 2.5 liter 200 horsepower SER Spec V. With 180 foot pounds of torque, things get done in a hurry. The fast lane for air starts at the single stage big bore intake, works through CVVT, designed to operate along a wider RPM range, and ends at the single high flow exhaust. Friction reducing technologies developed from racing help this engine spin freely. At the end of the straightaway, you'll find the payoff, an extended stay at every ringer's favorite destination, the red line. Two hundred free revving horses don't like to get saddled with any extra weight, so every part of the SER was scrutinized. Nissan engineers were so fanatical about saving weight that even the aluminum intake was swapped out for an even lighter resin molded one. But the SER's engine is also a model of strength, beefed up with the components you'd expect in an all-out performance engine. Whether it's a perfectly timed downshift or snagging the next gear at redline, your transmission needs to keep up. The Spec V's six-speed close ratio design lets you stay in the meat of the power band. With triple cone synchros to handle the mountain of torque and aluminum pedal pads with rubber inserts to keep you ahead of the action. The SER's drivetrain has proven itself at the ring. A non-stop mix of hard acceleration, sustained flat-out runs, and constant stirring of the close ratio, six-speed manual transmission. The first stage of testing is complete. Section manager Yasufumi Okadome shares the team's vision of building a great driver's car. In designing the SER, we sought to achieve Nissan-ness. It's the joy of driving. That, we believe, is the essence of Nissan. Joy comes in many forms. Take the carousel. It's one of the most famous parts of the ring and one of the most challenging. A 30-degree bank puts a heavy load on the chassis. Broken stretches of concrete take jabs at the suspension. Driver and car both take a beating. The SER fights back with reinforcements to the engine bay and a unique trunk-mounted V-brace. It's the perfect complement to the Spec V's sport-tuned suspension, ready for anything the Nürburgring has in store. Start with changes in elevation, broken pavement, decreasing radius turns, then add berms, gravel traps, guardrails, and more. The ring may be nicknamed the Green Hell, but it's heaven for this suspension. Next up, a real test for the driver. Between Collinhard and Versiphon is a downhill left-right combination loaded with challenges. The steep grade pitches you into the turn, but the off-camber turn-in point requires a steady hand. Nerves of steel are nice. The SER makes sure there's technology to back you up. Speed-sensitive power steering receives instant messaging from the road. 
while the Spec V's helical limited slip transforms pure power into inspiring traction. Thanks to 17 inch summer compound W rated tires on lightweight alloy wheels. Those big wheels and tires create space for big brakes. And at Brightshide, you'll need them. A long downhill straightaway is a great way to build up speed. But a corner at the end becomes a challenge for brakes. The Spec V meets the challenge with huge 12.6 inch front rotors. They proudly wear the badge they've earned. The SER has been pushed to its limits around the ring. No excuses were allowed and none were needed. Nissan-ness only comes from complete commitment to performance. We wanted to create a sporty, personal space, so we used seats with an excellent holding ability, a steering wheel with a comfortable feel, a black interior, and so on. It's a place that separates the real drivers from the wannabes. Vipperman, a quick right, left, right, negative camber series. Full concentration is required and an interior that lets you get down to business. The SER puts all controls close at hand, including the shift lever, mounted rally style on the console. While racking up cornering Gs, your allies are body-hugging front sports seats, a thick padded sports steering wheel, and aluminum pedal pads with rubber inserts. To a race car driver, there's no such thing as information overload. Everything's important to going fast. Large gauges with daytime illumination tell you everything at a glance. That's good, because at the ring, you're too busy watching the track. An oil pressure gauge keeps track of vital info, while a unique G-meter confirms the thrust of the Spec V's engine and the stopping power of those massive brakes. While performance comes first with the SER, the style and passion that went in are easy to find. In the red stitching echoed throughout the cabin, even on the seat belts. Driving the ring may be great fun, but it's also serious business. This interior makes sure you have the tools for the job.